Good morning, everyone. It's officially Wednesday. I am about to get my coffee. Um, I did I did just eat two of those egg bites with a little bit of sugar-free ketchup on top. So good. Now I'm getting my coffee here and I'm watching Wonder Years I, still. I gotta take out some stuff for you guys to throw out. Where is my heavy cream? Oh, there it is, you guys. I'm losing it. I'm losing it, I'm losing it, you guys. Oh, sorry, you guys. What the heck? I was trying to find my heavy cream. It was like in the way back. I thought I was like losing it. <laughs> and then today I'm going to put in Italian sweet cream with it. Kids here. So you guys, today my sister like, I think I told you guys this. So the other day my sister had her baby, and then Sunday um my father brought my niece home, and I guess they allowed him to go in and see the baby. But you just have to have like your mask on, and they want you to just like wash your hands. So I guess like my sister's husband was like, well you know it's only fair that. You allow the rest of them to come see him if you allowed your father, I guess. So, today at 12, my mom and I are going to go see the baby. I'm so excited, you guys. You know me, I love babies. I love all babies. Love babies. So, we're going to go see the baby today at 12 o'clock. But those egg bites are really good, you guys. They're really good. Um, they last for a while in your fridge, I guess. You can even freeze half of them and if you want. But I just keep them in my fridge because I eat like two a day. Except I didn't have any yesterday. I like completely forgot about them yesterday. And I had um, like two fried eggs and a sausage patty yesterday. So, so you guys, today I like to put whipped cream top of my coffee um you guys i am at my lowest right now today i am at my my lowest i am at my lowest my lowest well not my lowest lowest that i want to be at sorry guys but my lowest at i've been like friday i was at the same weight and then ugh, i don't know what happened friday i think i may, maybe had too much salt friday or something and it made me retain some water or something because then i gained like two pounds on friday i think i told you guys that and then for some reason the same day i gained like a pound so i'm finally down to what i was on friday today and i'm so excited because i can see myself losing hold on guys i can see myself losing another half a pound tomorrow definitely since i've been loving this whole like fasting at three o'clock and not eating till the next day it's been awesome, you guys. Awesome. But I'm watching some Wonder Years, you guys. I love this. I love this. Love this. And here's my coffee, you guys. Mmm. So good. So good, you guys. But I'm going to sit here, you guys, and watch some Wonder Years. And then I am going to... um. I think I'm going to make sure I sweep them up my floors before I leave today. But there's not really much else I need to do around here. Um, probably just um, bring laundry upstairs that I did yesterday. Just be casual. Don't look anxious or nervous. Be yourself. And that's about it. So. Um, oh, you guys. So such a freaking idiot oh my god so i have like a whisk and i was thinking i'm sure i can whisk up my heavy cream 
and put it on top of my like cold brew. Like I'm sure I could do that. So last night, you guys, like I told you guys last night, so I was sitting here at about 10.30. I started getting exhausted. Then I went upstairs and I couldn't sleep. And I think it was because I had that coffee yesterday afternoon. And normally I only have one coffee a day. And yesterday I had two. So I think that's why I like went right when I went upstairs and I wasn't in this chair anymore. I was wide awake. I'm telling you, I'm seriously thinking about becoming a bachelor again. I mean, look at you. So... I'm thinking that's what happened, you guys. So I'm not going to have that extra coffee this afternoon. You know, I love having my, like, iced coffee with the cold foam. It's been, like, ever since I had one at, at, like, Starbucks, I've been loving them. I've been, like, wishing that I can go over to Starbucks every morning and get one. But that's very, very expensive. <laughs> Kevin. Kevin. Very expensive for me to go over there, like, every day and get a coffee. Oh, my God. Unless I got, like, unless I happen to get, like, a gift card for Christmas or something or whatever for there. Then I could go there and use my gift card. But I wouldn't use it like every day because then I'd be gone. It'd be gone. Now, Linda said just be myself. So, a little hesitation for just the right So, but I'm going to so drink my yummy coffee here, you guys. Monica says that she does the same thing. She puts cinnamon in her coffee and then she puts some cream and then some more cinnamon on top. I so, so good. But yeah, you guys. Oh, I actually have a shipping label that I need to print off. A shipping label. That's what I need to print off and get that sent out. So that's the one thing that I do need to do before I leave with my mom today. Um, is go do that. So I'm going to drink my coffee, you guys. And I'll see you guys a little bit later. Hey, guys. Um, it is about 11.26 now. I'm, I'm making, I'm making, I just got done with Aubrey's Zoom call for, with her therapist and then I was just talking to my sister. Um, I made this wrap, you guys. So I have a four net carb wrap here and I have some of that black and chicken strip. It's one carb for three ounces, I believe is the serving. I actually got my scale out and I weighed out the meat. And then I have lettuce in here and then I have some ranch because of the chicken being hot and then a little bit of mozzarella cheese and it is so good so good i'm trying to eat something before i leave to go to my sister's um so that i can like eat something like a bigger type of meal before i go there just in case if when i get back i have to stuff something down before three o'clock so but that's what's going on you guys Oh, this is so good. This is a four point wrap, you guys. Four point. Four net carb, I should say. <laughs> Golden Girls. <laughs> so, I'm charging up my phone right now, you guys. It really needs to get charged. Um, and everything. So. Um, I'm gonna sit here, you guys. I'll see you guys before I leave. My mom should be here at like 11:45 to come get me if she's on time. I'm actually gonna think I'm gonna call her now and find out. But you guys, hey, I did my nails. I did my nails. While I was sitting here earlier. So, but I'm gonna call my mom and see what's going on, and I'll see you guys before I leave. Guys, it's 11:48. Uh, my mom should be here any minute. That's why I'm already like in my my coat and everything. So you guys saw how I had that um, wrap. Well, I did have a yogurt, my Too Good yogurt, vanilla. Put a little bit of blue, um, blueberries on it with a little bit of cream. And then I'm going to bring this Atkins peanut butter cup with me. I'm going to stick it in my pocket and, and bring it with me. Um, um, I don't know what I'm going to have when I come back for my like last, last thing. I might have like a little bit of celery with, with a tablespoon of my all natural peanut butter is what I might have. I think that's what I'm gonna have. And then I'll be done for the night. So I'm gonna unplug my phone and wait for my mom. She's coming. She said she was on her way, so she should be here soon. Oh, you guys, so I got this blanket a couple months ago for my sister and I haven't given it to her yet, but I have it here to bring and everything like that, so. But I need to, so you guys, I remember I told you guys last night how Walmart didn't have any of my lemons. So I got to stop at Price Shopper before I come home and get lemons too. So I can have some lemon water tonight. Um, 
I'm trying to drink it's like a lot of water you guys a lot of water they have like this gallon jug that has like the times on it on Amazon I really want it I really want it maybe if, like if I get a gift card or whatever I'll get it for Christmas or whatever but for now just wait and just use the water bottles for now but so I got the um thing that I had to send out it's outside in my mailbox for the mailman to take so that will be good that's already sent out um i ordered something for frank on ebay for christmas i'm not gonna say obviously i'm not gonna say but i did order him something on ebay and it was like four bucks with like i think like four or five dollars for shipping but it was like the thing was four bucks it was like a bid and that shipped out so i have that and um i already have like a whole bunch of stuff that's in my car for Christmas. I'm going to order like right December 1st. I'm going to order it. So. But my mother should be here any minute you guys. I'm actually going to call her because she should be here by now. So I'm actually going to call her and find out where the heck she's at. And I'll see you guys um, later when I come back. Hey guys. 2.32. I am home. Um, went to my sister's. Got to see my nephew. He's so cute. Uh, too bad I wasn't able to like smooch him. <laughs> As weird as that sounds. Because my sister at first, you guys, she wasn't going to allow anybody to see him until he got, like, his shots and everything. But I guess she just changed her mind on that. But we did have to wear our mask the whole time and wash our hands. So, can't complain. If somebody's letting you, if somebody's changing their mind and letting you go, then you can't complain, right? Definitely when it's not your child, it's their child. So, but, so cute. Oh, you guys, so then after... I had my mom bring me to Price Shopper real quick because when I did buy Walmart delivery last night, you guys, they didn't have my um my lemons. They didn't have my lemons. So I went and picked up a bag of lemons at Price Shopper and then I picked up Aubrey's um kid cuisines here real quick. Um that she likes. Get these in here. Come on, come on, come on. I know I can fit them in here. Okay. There we go, you guys. Then I got a bag of lemons. And then you guys, across the street from me, right near the Price Shopper is a GNC. Oh, crap, almost dropped my lemons. And I went and got some goodies. Um, this is the new one right here. Spicy sweet chili. I got sour and ch cheddar and sour cream. I got barbecue. And then I got sour cream and onion. So I got those. And then I got this new cup here. It's a Quest, um... Two peanut butter cups, 11 grams of protein, one net carb. So those chips plus this was 13, which I feel is not bad, you guys, because for the amount I got one, two, three, four bags plus this for 13 is not bad. I feel like it would have been more at Walmart because at Walmart, I think those bags are like three something a piece. Um, so two or three something a piece and i never go to gnc you guys like but i wanted to see if they had those chips that i wanted to try and they were having a sale on the rest of them so i grabbed it but you guys i'm gonna have my last meal for the day mm. i'm gonna have um some of that chicken tuna egg salad that i made the other day and then i'm gonna have um i think a celery stick with it and then maybe a bag of those chips. That's what I'm gonna have you guys. For my like last meal of the day. I'm just gonna get a spoon out here. Let me get it out. So, and I put a little bit of um, relish in it too. So good. So good. So. 
I'm going to put just half of this here. There we go. Put this back in the fridge. celery stock with it and then I think I'm gonna have one tablespoon of peanut butter instead of having the chips so one stock of celery oh goodness actually you guys I'm going to put some sour cream on my celery. Oh, sorry, I'm like all over the place here, you guys. All over the place. And I'm going to put some, cel some cream cheese on. I'm going to get a paper plate here. So here's my paper plate. I'm going to put some cream cheese on and put some everything but the bagel seasoning. I think that's what I'm going to do, you guys. That's what I'm going to do. good so so good and then i'm gonna get my everything but the bagel look how huge this thing is you guys and i'm gonna put it right on top of there and there we go you guys so i'm gonna go eat this i've got some of the chicken and tuna and egg and a celery stick with some cream cheese. Um, this is gonna be my last little meal for the day, you guys. My last little bit of food here before three o'clock because it is 2.39. So I'm gonna eat this, you guys, and I'll see you guys before I go get Aubrey. Oh, guys, it's 3.05. I'm outside waiting for Aubrey. It is cold, I have my North Face on my Albin winter coat on, my hat on, and my gloves on. I'm all pinked out. <laughs> it is cold. So cold. I'm gonna have Aubrey wear like her winter coat tomorrow. Oh. But yeah, guys, I'm just waiting for Aubrey. And then we're gonna head home. So I'll see you guys after. Okay guys, we're home now. Um, I'm just getting Aubrey some food. I have like two coat zeros a day that's all the soda that i have a day so i usually just put it in this like glass like um mason jar type style cup um right here with some ice and that's the only soda i have a day you guys is two of these a day and that's it then i drink like my coffee and then my flavored like my flavored water or my lemon and water so i'm gonna get some of it now while arby's food is cooking It was chilly outside, you guys. I had to wear, as you guys saw, I had to wear my winter coat and my other coat. And then I had to wear um, my hat and gloves. I don't know why the heck I do this to myself and tie this bag all the time. Can never get it. Can never get it.
Okay, here we go. Okay. Oh, you guys, my goodness. I'm gonna watch some Wonder Years tonight. Get this ice to go down here. There we go. That's what I'm gonna watch tonight, some Wonder Years. There's six seasons and I'm on season three. So I feel like I can get them done by the end of the weekend. I can definitely get them done. If I watch, watch them like this weekend too, then I can definitely get them done. So. <sighs> that weather, you guys, that weather. Oh my God, you guys. So this whole talk about another shutdown pisses me off, okay? Pisses me off because we had a shutdown in March. There were still a whole shitload of cases. So what makes you think if we have another shutdown, it's gonna go away? Like, we do not need another fucking shutdown. What we need is that fucking vaccine. Vaccine, oh my God. Vaccine is what we need. And I know it's going to be, like, mandatory that the kids get it, obviously. But I feel like that's what we need. We don't need another lockdown. What is it? Like, and then again, I feel like the people who aren't following the rules are the ones who are hurting it for the rest of us. Like, I follow the rules. I did everything that I needed to do when I went away. I came home and did everything they told me to do. I, I was even home, you guys, for three to four days with me and Frank wearing our masks in front of Aubrey. Like, we did what we did what they told us we had to do. There's... Ow, oh, crap. Um, we did what we were supposed to do, what the law says to do. So, if people don't follow the law, then those are the people that are hurting it for everybody. Hurting everything, making it worse for everybody. Like, those are the people. Because they don't listen. And I feel like they... The whole talk about them... Um, finding people is all basically a scare tactic. Because they don't actually find anybody. They should be like... If they don't want people going into all these other states... They should have cops at the borders of where you can go into each state... And stop people from coming in. I understand that they might have to get more manpower and everything to do that. But if you're trying to control people from coming in from state to state, then if you're not really taking control, then it's useless. Because people are not going to listen. Not going to listen. So I'm going to give this to Aubrey real quick. Like I said, they're not going to, people aren't going to listen. So it's never going to go away, ever. Here you go, Aubrey. Don't spill it, please. Ooh, not into the vacuum cleaner. Um, but I'm going to be oh, so aggravated if they do another freaking stupid lockdown. So stupid. And then that stimulus check, you guys know my opinion about the stimulus check. I think the people who can't, who literally cannot work, like their job is shut down, the business is shut down because of COVID, should be getting a stimulus check. Not everybody who should be getting a stimulus check. That's my opinion. Like, I shouldn't get one. People who still have their job every single day, yeah, your hours may be cut a little bit. I understand that. Like, I understand your hours do get cut. But if you are literally out of a job, don't have a job or nothing, those should be people getting the checks. I think there's this guy from, from Shark Tank. I think he said something like that. Something like that. One of the guys on there, he said something about how it shouldn't go to literally everybody. It should only go to the certain people who actually need it because they literally are out of a job. I believe that's what he said. The Shark Tank guy there. Um, which I agree. Not everybody in this world should be getting in this world. 
but not everybody should be getting the stimulus check. No. And then the only reason why the stimulus check has the second stimulus check hasn't gone through is because you got that old bat Nancy Pelosi and the rest of her little liberal gang there who want them to add all this other stuff into the check that has nothing to do with COVID. And of course, um, the House and the Senate or whatever it is isn't going to approve that. The um, stimulus check is supposed to be for COVID reason, not for anything other than COVID. So why are you trying to add in all this extra stuff that has nothing to do with COVID? I don't know. That's the reason why it hasn't gone through. Because they can't agree on it. But I haven't been on social media, guys. This is the only... Okay, if you want to consider YouTube social media, okay, I'm on social media, but I'm only on here. I'm not on Instagram anymore. I haven't been on, actually Saturday made a week, you guys. Saturday made a week that I haven't been on Facebook. I haven't been on Instagram. I haven't been on Twitter. I haven't been on any of that in like a week. Saturday made a week. So, and it actually feels so nice not having to see any of that crap or deal with anybody that are a bunch of idiots. Nuh-uh. I'm so glad I don't have to deal with any of that. And you guys, it actually saves my battery a lot too. <laughs> I don't have to charge my phone so much now that I don't have any, all that stuff on my phone. Because I literally deleted the apps, you guys. I didn't just like log out of it and just leave it. I literally deleted the apps on my phone. So it made room on my phone and I don't have to charge my phone as much anymore. So... I guess that's a pro for doing that. Oh my God, you guys, that wrap I had for lunch was so good. With that black and chicken strips, three ounces of black and chicken strips, and then the um, the um, ranch and the shredded lettuce, a little bit of sh shredded cheese. So good on the um, four net carb wraps it was so good okay so i'm gonna go sit and relax with aubrey um i have my drink here this is two cups here two things of coke zero there's there's is like a little bit that doesn't end up fitting that i just end up drinking from the um can but this is it you guys this is what i have every day two cans and that's it hey guys it's late it's 11 20 um i got my steps in for the day I'm sitting here watching some Nicole Bur Burgess. I love this lady. She's awesome. Um, but I need to go upstairs and take my shower, you guys. I need to go take my shower. Um, so, you guys, I decided with COVID and everything going on, like, um, what was supposed to be planned was me and Frank were going to go to his family for Thanksgiving, which he could still be going with his family. I just know that me and Aubrey are going to be going with my family now to my stepfather's house. Um, it's going to be me, Aubrey, my stepfather, my brother, his girlfriend, and their kids, and then Aubrey. So, I don't know if Frank's going to come with me or if Frank's going to be with his family. So, I'm not sure which one, but we. Um, I decided to do that because I don't want to be part of the problem. Like, people are out there not following the rules, and that's why we might have a shutdown. So, I don't want to be one of the people to not follow the rules and like because our governor says no more than 10 people and they don't they only want you basically with your family they don't want you with people who aren't your family or that you're not with all the time or you don't you don't live with or, and stuff like that so yeah but if he goes with his family then he can, he'll just come here after afterwards and everything but so that's what we're going on and I'm gonna be making like this green dessert that is a family favorite on my mom's side of the family. Um, and then I'm gonna be making my own, um, it's like a low carb Brussels sprout dish. And then I'm gonna be bringing my own um, cauliflower mash, mash cauliflower. And then I'm thinking about making a keto um, or like a low carb keto type of pumpkin pie. Um, my brother's girlfriend just bought a frozen pie, but I'm not gonna eat that, you guys. So I'm thinking about making, finding some like really good dessert to bring. Cause my stepfather's a diabetic too. So if my brother's girlfriend isn't making anything that's not sugar free or anything like that, then my stepfather's gonna be eating it when he really shouldn't be. So 
I'll probably make like a keto like pumpkin pie or something like that. Or I'll go online and look at like desserts or something like that and make something. But um, I, I am going to make that green stuff and all that. So, but. So, guys, I'm finishing this episode um, with Nicole Burgess, and then I'm going to go upstairs and take my shower. So, I'll see you guys after. Hey, guys. Um, I did take a little body shower, but I didn't wash my hair. I'm going to take a full, full shower tomorrow. But I'm here in bed, you guys. I'm going to head to bed because I'm so tired. You guys, I was looking through all my stuff. And I realized I've lost 30 pounds since January. So I know that's not much. But I feel like that's really good. It, it is good at least. It is, it's something, right? So 30 pounds since January. So yeah. But I'm going to head to bed, you guys. I'm just laying here watching some TV. I'm going to shut my light off and go to bed. So I'll see you guys in the morning.